top and get a group together. They go, oh, wow! A big hit there for the 85. That was Brent Raymer sliding into the wall. Throttles hung wide open, yeah, too. He's going to yeah. hit it again. Oh, right back in front of the God few trucks. Man. Like you mentioned, that throttle being hung took him right back into the wall. And that's a that's no safer barrier there. That's concrete. Yeah, Brent was doing a great job running up in the lead draft. What happened? It just get loose with him off turn two, you think? Yeah, we saw him get real, real loose the last time. I was watching him, and he was at the tail end of this lead lap draft, and he got real loose coming off to the previous lap. That was a huge hit. I hope he's okay. Big hit coming off of turn number two. Safety crews getting to him quickly. That that first hit, you know, he was braced for it. But if it happened to, to stun him or daze him, when that thing drove into the wall the second time, you know, he, he would have been, he wouldn't have been ready for that. Yeah, it looked like the throttle was hung, though. It looked like the rear wheels were spinning after he hit the, make the initial contact. Okay. Now, remember, Michael, I told you the lap before it looked like he got really, really loose coming off turn two. We're going to take a look back at the previous lap now. Watch this. Now, watch the black truck at the very end. This is the lead lap draft right here. Right there. That's Brett Raymer. Keep an eye on him at the very pack, back of that pack. Keep keep going. Watch that truck come off the corner. This is the previous lap. See, he gets sideways, Mikey. Oh, and he does a nice job saving it. And it looks yeah. like the crash is just a... A replay of that, yep. only a little bit worse. Now let's see what happens now. This look, he's he's going to be right up your screen. Ooh, hard contact, and I, there wasn't another truck anywhere near him. It looks like something may have broken on his truck or something to sit him in the wall like that. Or maybe did he get loose and maybe overcorrected? Over yeah, it looked like if if what happened the lap before happened again, he might not have been as fortunate with his save. Now watch this thing pound the wall one more time. And as you mentioned, no safer barriers, but the good news is... Watch this now, Mikey. Watch this. You see, oh, he got loose right on the bottom and then overcorrected, shot right across the racetrack into the outside wall. I mentioned good news. Brent Raymer is climbing out of that truck. Jim right, right there going straight back into the outside wall. Man. Already stunned from that first impact. There That's he is Brent right Raymer there. right there. The guys are helping him. I tell you what. What a tough hit, a tough kid Brent Raymer is. Yeah. And, what, and, what a, and what a testament to the oh safety boy. of these vehicles. The 85 of Brent Raymer on fire on the front stretch. A lot of damage to the front of that. You see Brent jumping out of that truck. Boy, I'm glad to see Brent get out of that truck. Well, that's a lot of fire You're right, Brent. See damage to the 39 of Ryan C. But Brent Raymer, another hard collision. Coming in, guys. Get ready to. To the front of that race truck. Middle view screen. That's Brett coming off of turn number four. He just caught on fire. Just simply caught on fire there. And it looks like it's inside the driver's compartment. Wow. Had to have a, a fuel line rupture or something like that, Michael. Had to be. Look at all the fire inside that cockpit. And then he hit the wall on top of all that, Phil. That's just so scary. It's so good to see Brett Raymer jump out of that truck. You don't think that engine just hand grenaded, do you? Well, yeah, there was that, no smoke. There yeah, was just fire. The fuel, why the right. fuel fire? Like and right. that looked definitely like a fuel fire. More than an oil fire. More than an oil fire. There was no smoke. Yeah. There was contact to the front of the truck after the fire broke out on this truck. Looked like Brett did a smart thing. Like he tried to get the thing spun around backwards so that fire would blow away from him, but wound up hitting the wall a little bit, but walks away. You're right, Rick. We talked about that crash you had at Daytona. I've never seen anything any scarier than 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 that. I mean, that, that was a terrible wreck. And then, But this one rivals that, that with that fire so, like that. Yeah, I'm fine. Second question is, are you tired of making our highlights? Because at Daytona, one of the hardest hits I've ever seen, and this weekend, a pair of them. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, we had the, the crash up here before earlier today, and then obviously the fire that uh, we just saw on the TV uh, just now during the race. And uh, yeah, yeah, it, it gets a little old, you know, getting on here and, and getting on TV, you know, wrecking or, or doing whatever. Uh, we're just trying to string together some good finishes here, so it's a little frustrating. What kind of a financial hit is this for today, Brent? Oh, two trucks, uh, motor. It's bad. I mean, that that's pretty much our whole fleet.